Hello, my stalwart fans. We are back once again with part 12 of our Fallout 4 playthrough. And I want to go find out what's on that island, so... I'm going to go swim to it. Even though I have a sneaking suspicion that there's going to be sweet F.A. That's okay, because sometimes in life... Oh, Jesus Christ. Seriously? Okay, fuck this. Screw that island. I'm going to get my power armor repaired. People have asked me for a long time. I put it off. Again and again. No more, I say. If I recall correctly, Longfellow's cabin has a thing that lets me do that. And nothing else. Okay. Shit. So, yeah, um, I was talking about it last week. So, for some reason, there's a really weird graphical bug around Sagos Ironworks. And I've confirmed it. It's still there. And I don't know why it does it. But it does. It just seems to, I don't know, cause my fans to go really, really badly. Really, really fast. Don't know why. Okay. We are going to... Yeah, we're going to do this one, actually. We're going all the way down here. Alright. We'll start at Kitter Ridge Pass and work our way down, sure. Why not? Alright, let's go. We're sucking down a lot of rats sticking around here. Does it even affect you? You're not gen... No, not gen anything. That's the whole argument of us not being a... A synth. We get affected by radiation. Stop bitching. If I recall correctly, there's some of them over there. I'm sure if I don't bother them, they won't bother me. Right. Well. I'm sure I can avoid it. You know, probably. <laughs> now let's take the high road. Like I usually do. As I am morally superior. What is this cave? Can I get up here? <clears throat> I probably can. Maybe not. Shit. Yep, I can. Using the age-old Skyrim method of just keep jumping until you manage to get over whatever it is you're trying to get over. Shit. There's a lot of them. Oh, bollocks. Uh, yeah, we'll clear the place out. Why not? Hey, guys. Oh. Oh. Ow. Why you do this? I literally feel no need to take cover. I am literally in a walking tank. I don't think I'll run. I'm uh, quite content with my current pace. Thank you. Oh, you cheeky shit. Your leg is mine. Thank you. You have paid the limb toll. Nah, I don't need any explosives. Where's that turret? There it is. Yeah. Come on. Show yourself. The hunt only makes me enjoy it more, and you don't want that. There you go, good lad. See, it's all saying legendary stalker or whatever, but these guys have very little armor. Which makes me question the effectiveness of their ability to fight. Powerful revolutionary sword. Eh. If I got a melee weapon already, I think I've got like a bat or something. Yeah. That sword weighs. Yeah, it's not worth it. Oh, what was that? 
Is that me or them? Is there not a cave here? Did it say cavern or tavern? I can't remember. Please stop reversing. It makes it more difficult for me to kill you. Thank you. Uh, so yeah, a bit of a graphical bug around Saugus Ironworks for whatever reason. Uh, I don't really know why. The video of which should already be out by the time this video is out. But uh, yeah, that was interesting. Right, so where is this guy? Also, where is Nick? Did he like just... Oh shit. Oh. Oh, there's the cavern there. Okay, right. Alright, some shit. Trip wires. And oh, he's just crying. He's stuck on a tree. Okay. Alright, so these guys seem to have shoved quite a number of people into strange things. Also, complete tangent. Ah, oh, what was that? Well, I'll say it when we get into the cave. If anyone here has not read any Terry Pratchett books, I greatly encourage you to reconsider that and go read some Terry Pratchett, because that is some of the best books I have read in a very long time. Like, what a genius. I can't believe he's dead. Such bullshit. Is this going to be another one of those caves where there's ghouls crawling around the ceiling like shits? Ready to scare the bejesus out of me. Because I would be uh, very appreciative if that was not the case. That's it. Oh. Okay, there's like no range in this gun. That's stupid. Yeah, this loot. Oh, much better. Even though my aim is pretty shit. Also, Elder Scrolls Valenwood, I don't really see the point, well, we can talk about it, I suppose, but chances are, if it's going to be confirmed by the time this video is out, it already will have been. In fact, I'm recording this on Sunday, so... E3 is tonight. Oh, fuck, E3 is tonight. Oh, good man, Nick. I'm, I'm really glad you decided to take the shortest route to the people that were killing me instead of following behind me, you jackass. Fuck's sake. Fucking hit him. It's really weird the way I shoot this gun. At least I think it is. Also, someone kept saying upgrade your guns. That is literally something I haven't even done. I haven't done that for anything yet. So, if you're wondering why my guns are not up to scratch, that is why I have neglected to maintain and or make them powerful. There's no real reason why. I just haven't. Are they though? Where did I get shot from there? Oh. Oh, he stepped into his own trap. Huh, dickhead. But yeah. Okay, tongs. They've been torturing people. Hmm. It's alright, little one. You can come out of your cover. I'm not going to hurt you. Much. See, this is when Nick's actually being effective. It's really, really rare, but it does happen. Eh. <laughs> Keep missing him. Shit. Ah, oh, well, Nick can handle it. Anything useful? Whoa. That was crazy. But it's okay. Because we've got everything we needed. Alright. Also, bobby pins are really, really common in this game. Like, there's Skyrim levels of common in that eventually I have so many, it's just impossible to run out of them. Which isn't a complaint, you understand? Hold on, need a drink of tea. Which isn't a complaint, it's just... I find it odd that they're so... Just so common, really. Also, my health regenerates very quickly. I won't say it's overpowered, but it's sort of game-breaking. And yeah, I know we said we'd do more story, and then I completely went off and didn't do story, but... Eh, you know, whatever. You're here for my usual blundering and muttering. If that's not what you came here for, you're in the wrong place. 
Hmm. Eh. Pipe pistol, no. Handcuffs, blowtorch. Hmm. Probably torturing people. Holy. I think it's the first bath I've actually seen with water in it in this game. Which is weird because some places do have water and baths, but just not usually the same time. Whoa. What the hell? That's pretty weird. It doesn't look like they packed the wall themselves, so why is there so much? Yeah, that is kind of odd. Hmm. Perhaps this is a cave of artificial significance? No, artifactual significance? Archaeological significance? Seriously, what the fuck? Did they pack this earth themselves? Why is there so many... Whoa, holy shit. Oh no, a grenade. Uh. Yeah. Power armor makes exploring a lot easier, but it certainly lowers the difficulty of the game. Someone said survival mode. Eh. Couldn't really be arsed. Eh. It's probably just the exit. No, actually? Hmm. You put up a good fight, little turret. Just not good enough. Ah, so much ammo. Uh, I'm running out of ammo for this gun, though. Mm -hmm. Whoa, what? Kitter Ridge Pass? Do not enter. Okay, so... Kitter Ridge Pass got overrun and it linked up to this cave. That is interesting. Okay, that's pretty cool. I never um, noticed that. Why do they need to say do not enter if all you can do is drop down into it? That seems kind of silly. Hmm. Oh well. Right, we'll get back outside and back onto the route of going to get that data. Or, you know, probably also the jig is up. I know what the Red Death is. Thank you for spoiling that in the comments, whoever that was, that would have been a cool surprise, but nope, I know what it really is. I'm not going to say for anybody who still wants to find out what it is by themselves, but... Yep, thanks for that. Mm, thought it was like a dog or something? It's just a light, it's okay. Okay, so it's not light outside, so why was it... ...telling me that? Ah, oh, whatever. I wonder if they were cooking this person. Hmm. It's always little stuff like this that, um... Makes you think, you know? About what's going on, etc. Why these raiders and trappers do what they do. Yeah. Hmm, are we near it? No, we are. Well, there's a few other stuff nearby, but... Okay, this is a town. Right, hold on. I need a weapon that can fire quicker. Yeah. This'll do... Oh. Please don't tell me most of these are gonna be, like, boarded up. I hate that. It's such a cop-out. Be a fish stall of some sort or a fisherman's something. Oh well, whatever. Onward we go.
I'm gonna get ambushed by something, aren't I? Ah, oh, definitely. It's gonna be fun, though, I can tell. It's gonna be great. What? Say what? Rod chicken? What is this sorcery? And it's a higher level than most of the trappers. What? What's going on like? <sighs> like rad rabbits? Okay. But rad chickens don't. What are you doing to me, Bethesda? Okay, why is my frame rate only sticking around 45? That's weird. Hmm. Southwest Harbor. The lesser har Far Harbor. Oh. Where'd that rod chicken go? We're gonna give him position away here, but it's a fucking rod chicken. I sort of have to go check it out. <gasps> bark, 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 bark. Oh, you're hurtless. I can pickpocket the rod chicken. Okay. Enough of those shenanigans. Let's get going here. Hmm? So they were shooting at something, but what? Fuck you. Da -da -da -da. Oh! Oh, okay. That was really weird. Does it look like a zombie or something? Alright, there's just loads of them just sitting here. Alright. Whoa, wait, what? Looks like a... Hold on. It's gonna shoot you in the face. Mm -hmm. This is an endless shot now. I don't think it was. Armor piercing, automatic, something or other. Blah, 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 I don't care. Can I get his stuff or. Yes, okay. Hmm. Doesn't really see really much point of having a watch for a boat. Right, is that a horseshoe crab? Because I'm pretty sure that's what Mirelurks are from. Like, it doesn't look like a baby Mirelurk to me. Whoa. What the fuck is that? The hell? There's all sorts of weird shit going on. I don't understand what's going on. Okay, so it, Oh, it's over here, right? Oh, I get it. The boat crashed and is not on fire. Oh. See, how are you dead? You should not be dead. It's only been like... A while? Whoa, what the fuck is all this stuff? It's a really... Victorious trunk. Where the fuck is Victoria's key? Who's Victoria? So many questions. Uh, this looks really pretty. Hmm. I'm gonna go up here though. I was gonna say what's the point in having a lookout for ships, but I guess that answered my question. from excuse you <gasps> he has a hook oh no wait he's just holding it that's disappointing captain hook get fucked 
Fuck you. Something out. <laughs> <laughs> Working out nicely. I just lost something, didn't I? And that was my arm. Shit. The Grim Trapper. Does this one have a hood as well? Because the other one did, and I thought, like, is that meant to be like the Grim Reaper because he's got a trapper helmet or a hood on or something? But. Nope, clearly not. Just. Oh, shit. Slightly disappointing. Any, what was that? It's not like they're hiding, they're just shooting at us, you buffoon. Ah, uh, Nick, please go take care of the problem, because you're just, you're getting on my tits now. Shithead. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh jeez, that's an ugly one. Sorry, I need a drink of tea there. Oh. Have to keep my strength up. Oh. Oh no, I'll have to use a stim pack. The first one I've had to use after getting shot by you retards for ages. Is that Nick shooting or me? If you can just wait a second. Thanks. I shot him in the leg so he wouldn't fall off the building for fuck's sake. Bullshit. Right, do they have any other interesting things? Boom. Oh. Nope, not really. Some random house with nothing in it. Oh, that's Nick. Jeez, he just comes out of the fog like a goddamn lurker. Like swiggity swooty. I'ma come for you, boy. Right. Sap bucket. Hmm. And uh, okay, yeah, that's where that's where I came from. The chicken. Take the shot. Oh, right, there was another one of those. Shit. Ah. I didn't realize. Well, I'm sure Nick will be fine. He's a sturdy kind of fellow. It's really lucky none of these cars explode, or I might have you in some for some trouble. Yeah, yeah. Or I might be in for some trouble. Couldn't figure out how to work my tongue there for a second. Hmm. Alright, I think this is a pretty good place to leave this video at. Among the carnage I've wrought in about 10 minutes, give or take. I wonder if that's the Vim factory over there. Oh, it is totally the Vim factory. What do you say, guys? Should we go to the Vim factory? Actually, wait, how will I even get across? Eh. Uh, Maybe not just yet. Yeah. Oh, all the zone. All right. Well, hope you enjoyed the episode. Oh, as always, any suggestions or feedback you have are appreciated, and I will see you in the next one. And goodbye.